Hello, everyone. I know you have been waiting for this powerful meeting, for this powerful conference that the Lord has put together to bless us, to set us on fire for him. There's a, an opportunity for you as a woman or as a young lady to hear the word of the Lord in, in, in a way that will set you, your heart, your spirit, your soul on fire and draw you closer to the Lord, especially your secret place. You are going to hear the words that are going to transform your destiny, that will set you on a course, a great course that is going to produce a long-term result in your life. This is the Women on Fire Conference, and today is the day one. And we are going to begin powerfully by the help of the Holy Spirit. Our guest is already in the house, so if you are watching, I want you to share this broadcast. Please share the broadcast. Invite your friends, invite your loved ones to be a part of this meeting. Just let them know that they don't want to miss this meeting. If you have been feeling spiritually cold, spiritually down, this is a time for a revival of fire. The Lord is beginning something in your life today. So please share uh, the broad broadcast. Invite as many as you can. Be a part of the blessing because everyone you invite who God touches you have also shared in their blessings and you have become a part of what God is doing in this place today we have the guest that God has prepared for us and I'm going to be bringing her you know on any moment from now prepare your heart prepare your mind because I tell you you are not going to remain the same again in the name of Jesus Christ so our guest is coming up on screen now all right she's live now She's on screen with us. She's by name uh, Teresa Benjamin, and the Lord has prepared her for a time like this. Can we celebrate the woman of God as we welcome her on stage? <laughs> You're Father, welcome, we ma'am. Thank you. Thank you, thank very you Lord much, Jesus. Ma. Thank you very mm. much, ma'am. I'm grateful for this privilege and this opportunity. Anytime I get an opportunity to share God's word, it's a great privilege. And I really thank you very much. And for as many that are connected, I pray that by an act of his mercy, after this meeting, fire will be sparked up in your bones. It might look like Amen. a short meeting, but there is no yes. time in eternity. There is no time mm. with God. Mm. There is no thought both Alpha and O. It's called Alpha Omega at the same time. Is this is the beginning and at the same time the ending? So I want to trust yes. Jesus that at the end of the day, your life will be transformed mm. in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. We are looking Amen. at Women on Fire conference. I before I got married, there's this thing that has always been in my head when I gave my life to Christ. I said, God, I cannot be born in for you like this as a young person, then get married and I'm nowhere to be found. Mm. I told mm. myself, I, I said, God, if you're not going mm. to help me when I get to that place, just mm. leave me as a single woman the way I am like this. Mm. It, was, it was a decision I made because I had gone through the lives of many women that I knew, both single and married, and their life was not telling anything good to me. It was not encouraging me. And I felt I was feeling very bad. Okay, I have a friend that I know, a very close sister. Her life motivated me to the point that I am like this when I was a single mm. lady. But now mm. she's married with kids, and her husband is asking her questions like, where are you? Where is the mm. fire that I saw before I married you? Mm. Mm. I can't mm. find you anymore. I need to, mm. please, where are you? And the lady is complaining almost every day. Another sister called me not too long ago and was asking me that, please, how do I pray? Mm. How do I find time to pray? Mm. She has one child. I have two. Presently, I'm a nursing mm. mother. I'm mm. a nursing mother. So she asked mm. how, I told her, well, basically, God has been helping me. But mm. when I gave birth to this, my son, We'll go into the word, but I just want to share something. When I gave yes, birth to my son recently, God taught me a way to maintain the altar and maintain the fire. Mm. Anytime I am breastfeeding, mm. it's a time for prayer for me. Mm. It's a prayer time. Mm. Anytime mm. I'm bathing my child, it's a prayer time. Mm. I receive revelations and inspirations from the spirit of God mm. whenever I am breastfeeding. Mm. Because then... Mm. The baby is not disturbing. Mm. So what, what excuse do I have? Mm. What excuse do I have? 
I am mm. bathing the child. The child is not disturbing at that point. What excuse do I have? Mm. I don't have an mm. excuse. Mm. I don't. So mm. I hear, I know people. Many people will say yes, activity, children, and everything. We don't have an excuse. We don't. Yes, ma. We don't. We don't. We don't. Mm. I, there was a day two yes, days ago. I was bathing my, my little child, and in the middle of bathing the child, I said I received a song by inspiration. And mm. my 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 four year old daughter mm. that was sitting beside me picked the song immediately and started mm. singing. And the mm. power of God filled that room and it led me to record the mm. prayer. I recorded mm. the prayer and sent it to some people and it sparked up fire almost immediately. Hallelujah. Just by bathing the baby. See, as I'm speaking mm. to us right now, the power of God is, mm. is, is everywhere where I'm sitting. Mm. Because yes. Jesus Christ wants women to stand mm. up. It pains yes. me when I see women and their value being wasted. When their mm. value is so precious in the sight of God, if only they can mm. pay the price. Mm. You are not a woman mm. by mistake. You are not yes, an accident. You are not an accident at all. Yes, God took his mm. time and knew you were going to come as a lady. And he knew mm. you were going to come as a woman. He knows there's going to be a point in your life you will get mad. He knows there's going to be mm. a point in your life you have children. He knows there's going yes. to be a point in your life where you're going to be a nursing mother. The Bible says mm. that he has made all things beautiful in his time. So mm. once you get Hallelujah. married, it is beautiful in God's time. Once you have yes, children, ma. it is beautiful in God's time. The moment yes, they start ma. growing, it is beautiful in God's time. Therefore, his Hallelujah. grace is available for you to do the mm. things that he has asked you to do that is beautiful Hallelujah. in his time. Hallelujah. In his time. Hallelujah. There are mm. a lot of women praying to have children. You, you have children mm. and you're making those children a, a problem to you from not seeking the face of the Lord. Do not make the, bless mm. do not make the blessings of God upon mm. your life look like a waste. Mm. Mm. No. Mm. No. Mm. No. I mm. wrote down something here. That there are things that only women can do. Mm. No man can give birth. Forget this thing that medical science are trying to do nowadays. Yes, no man can give yes, birth. Even in the mm. animal world, it's the women that give birth. It's the mm. women that lay their heads. Mm. Some women will have to rise mm. up if yes, what God wants to do in this time will find yes, expression. Ma. Yes, ma'am. You and I have to rise up. Mm. I'm a working mother. Mm. Yes, I ma. work. I have two mm. kids. I have a mm. husband. I have a mm. husband that's into ministry. Mm. And I have my own that the Lord placed in my hand. Mm. And in the sight of God, none mm. must suffer. Hallelujah. Mm. None must suffer. We have some women mm. that they are, they are, their families are, are suffering and their jobs are enjoying. <laughs> mm. Their families are suffering, their jobs are enjoying. Mm. All their, mm. their, their jobs are suffering, their families are. But mm. something is the most important thing is many of them have lost the place and have lost the touch with God. Mm. And, mm. and it's painful. Mm. It's painful. It's painful. Some things are mm. happening today because the women have not stood up. Yes, ma'am. I decided one day we're going to go into scripture briefly, but I need to step yes, up fire in your bones. Yes, ma'am. We need to understand what is happening. The mm. world is the way it is today because women have abandoned their knees. Mm. They have thrown their knees elsewhere mm. and they are focusing on frivolities. Mm. They are majoring on the minor and minoring on the major. The major. <laughs> we don't know where our, our knees are anymore. Our mm. voices in the place of prayer cannot be found. The Bible mm. says that the name Jesus, mm. things in heaven on earth and beneath the earth must bow. Scripture says Hallelujah. that Jesus, I know, Paul, I know, who are you? Mm. Mm. The moment you begin mm. to crawl upon the Lord, can the devil say the same thing about you? Mm. Can the mm. devil say, I know you, Victoria. I mm. know you, Annabelle. Mm. But mm. can he mention your name? Mm. Mm. It's painful. Mm. It, 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 it is painful mm. and it is disheartening seeing the yes, things happening these days. 
Yes, I got touched with some things that were going on in the life of my husband. I was not impressed with it. I took it mm. upon myself to go on a seven days as a married woman. Mm. To go on a seven days fasting and prayer because of him. And a seven mm. days vigil because mm. of this man. In the mm. middle of the vigil, a witch mm. appeared in my house. Not hmm. individual, no. Yes. The witch came and was warning me that hmm. how do, who am I to try to alter what they have done? And mm -mm. I said, hey, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you made a mistake. Uh, mm. The fact that I am mm. married, people say the two shall become one. The fact that I'm married one. to this man, whatever mm. is touching him is touching me. Exactly. If he's mm. enjoying, I'm enjoying. If exactly. he's happy, I'm happy. So yes. I, I, I am going to take this matter up till till you you, you clear out of his life. Now, mm -hmm. if what I was doing was not important, it just which would not have she appeared. If you invite her, mm. yes, ma. <laughs> do you understand? I stood yes, on my ground mm. to make sure that mm. some things do not find expression in my home. Hello, my mm. home is my territory. Mm. I mm. rule that territory. Mm. It's mm. where I rule. The Lord put me yes. there to guard that yes, territory, sir. to keep that yes. territory. So if anything yes. comes into that territory without me knowing, I should be flogged. Mm. Yes. <laughs> I should be flogged. If anything happens to my husband without me first knowing, I should be punished. Mm. Yes, if anything happens mm -hmm. to my children without mm. me knowing, mm. I should be flogged. Mm. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. in the first place, I have been put there mm. as a territorial watchman. And so I must stand on my guard as a mm. watchman. Mm. Mm. Oh, Jesus. Mm. The you, women Jesus. must arise. Yes, Lord. Hey, thank you, hey, Jesus. Can we turn mm. briefly to the book? Let's mm. look at the book of Acts. Mm. Mm. Huh. Acts 1 verse 14 is a popular 1 verse 14. Let me see. Hallelujah. Acts chapter 2. Let me just look at Acts 2. Mm. I'll read for verse 1 briefly. I know it was not part of what I gave, but 2 verse 1. He said, And when the day of Pentecost mm. was fully come, they were all with one accord in one place. And suddenly there mm. came a sound from heaven as of a rushing mighty wind. And it filled all the house where they were sitting. And there appeared unto them cloven tongues like as of fire. And it sat upon each of them. And they were all mm. filled with the Holy Ghost and began Hallelujah. to pray. And began to speak with other tongues as the Spirit gave them utterance. Now, Hallelujah. if we look if we look at this scripture very well, we we see the word they, them, mm. they, mm. them. Mm. There mm. was no specification if it was only men or it was only mm. women. Mm. But later we found out that Mary, the mother of Jesus, was here. Mary Magdalene was here. Mm. Yes, ma'am. So the, the anointing and the spirit of God is not gender-based. Mm. It's mm. not. The anointing mm. is not only for men. Mm. Mm. It is not. It is not yes, gender-based. Yes, ma'am. It is not mm. at all. So if you as a lady, you feel, oh, this assignment is not womanly. Mm. Let me leave it for the men. Mm. Then where will you place women like Catherine Coleman? That mm. did what some men cannot do. Mm. Mm. I don't know if I'm making sense. Mm. The yes, anointing is not gender based. It mm. can fall on both male mm. and female. Mm. Mm. The most important thing is, are you mm. yielded? Mm. Are you mm. yielded? How open are you to the spirit of God? The Bible says that they were filled with the Holy Ghost and began to pray in tongues. They spoke in tongues by the inspiration of the spirit of God. And it was both men and women. The women were baptized with fire. 
just like the men also were baptized with fire. Mm. The baptism of Thank fire you. is not is not gender gender based. Mm. I made up my mind that I will not be at the back when I'm supposed to be. Mm. In fact, the, according to my father in the Lord, he said the safest place to be in a, in a formation is in the front. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I choose mm. to be in the front. I cannot sit mm. down with the oil of God upon my life just because mm. some a society has termed me a woman. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I'm a woman not by mistake. I'm a woman because I am the one that will give birth to the next generation. I'm a generation carrier. I'm a gen I am a life giver. So I will not just sit down and allow things go by like that. No. No. If the women folk don't stand up and don't arise, nothing will happen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Oh, Jesus. There is a need to arise. There is a need to arise. You find some sisters all just moving all around aimlessly. What is on their head is, let me just get married, let me get a job, let me, that's all that. But I have made up my mind. The Bible yes, says, I am the children that you have given unto me, that we are for signs, signs and we are for wonders. wonders. I have made up mm. my mind that every seed that proceeds out of me will be for sign and for wonder. And for my wonders. husband will be for sign and for wonder. Everybody that comes close to me will be for a sign and for a wonder. I will not sit down and allow the anointing and the grace of God hey. upon my life go to waste just because I'm a Hmm. Bushida brazanda bo kili azindi abo shida kanda buzi. Mazida bra shanda kili azanda bo shida buzi. I reject it. Mm. And mm. I can be used by the Lord. So, so long Hallelujah. as I make myself available. Mm. Sisters, mm. sisters, women, women, please mm. stand up from where you are. Dust your mm. bed and get up. Mm. The world is waiting. Mm. There's more to Hallelujah. you than what you see. Mm. Mm. There is more mm. to you than what you see. Mm. The yes, place of prayer can never be they can never be brought low. Get mm. up, look for where your needs mm. are. Go down yeah, with your needs. That about. situation mm. in your family can change. Yeah, that situation yes, in the life of your children can change. Yes, your family yes, will never Masi remain the same about. unless you rise. That can be a brazil can never about. do. Alabos. Thank you, Jesus. You find calamities in your in the mm. family. Mm. You see issues going on in the family. Mm. Unless you rise up as a woman, those things will continue. Now, you say your children are the reason why you cannot do some things that you're doing. If those children mm. go back tomorrow, they will blame you. Mm -hmm. They will blame you. <laughs> hey, they will blame you. When my oh, baby was in my womb, I kept speaking into her life. When my mm. daughter, and do you know, to mm. the glory at age two, this girl is seeing visions that me I'm not seeing. Ah, mm. She mm. woke up one morning and said, Mommy, see, there's an angel standing by the window. I said, Jesus mm. Christ. I could only mm. feel the presence, but she mm. was seeing the angel. Why? Because a woman she decided to mm. open her womb and say, Never, mm. I am a generation carrier, I'm a generation keeper, I'm a gatekeeper, mm. I'm a watcher. Mm. Therefore, nothing mm. sees me and nothing happens mm. to my seed without mm. me knowing. Mm. 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 The Bible mm. speaks in the book of Luke, chapter 2, verse 36 and 37. Mazedi kanda brasha kili galabos muzindi ya shaki labaz. Prophetess mm. Anna mm. is a woman mm. that lost mm. her husband at a very early age, but this mm. woman did not allow it keep her down.
the bible says that she took mm. it upon herself to be in the temple praying for the redemption of israel not praying for another Hallelujah. husband mm. she found worth mm. and value in herself she knew that okay she has an assignment to do and she has a destiny mm. to fulfill Mm. She took it upon herself to pray for the liberation and the redemption of Israel. A mm. woman. Mm. Ah, God. My life will not be useless. My life will not be useless. My life will be useful. My life will be useful. In the name of Jesus. You know, it would have been mm. difficult for Prophetess Anna to identify mm. Jesus yes, just ma. by herself. Mm. But because she has spent years on her knees, mm. years mm. in the place of prayer, mm. when mm. she saw prophecy, she identified it. Mm. Mm. When she saw mm. prophecy being fulfilled, prophetess Anna mm. identified it that mm. this is the one that I have been praying about. They brought she cut about. She identified mm. it. Hey, hey. How many of us can oh, identify the kanda prophecies over bo, the life of our bo, children? Bo, How many of us? And I know somebody bo. somewhere out there is saying, "Ah, you will mm. not understand. I have a lot mm. of children around me. Hello, mm. mm. have you heard of Susan Wesley? Mm. Hey." <laughs> Uh, oh, she so had 19 that. children. Nine, yes, 19. And 10 Thank died. You, ma. But she was still able to produce John and Charles Wesley. Mm -hmm. That the both of us <laughs> are speaking of today. Mm. Uh, Hallelujah. Kande bo zika da ba zele kende abo. Susan Wesley hey. gave a day mm. to each child. Mm. Every day mm. to each child, mm. praying for mm. each child because mm. she knows if it is good, mm. it will come to her. Mm. If it is bad, yes. it will still come to her. It will come to her. Mm. It will come to her. Mm. Mm. What are you focusing mm. on, mm. sisters? What are you focusing mm. on? What is what is okay, pushing okay, you? Okay, what okay, is driving okay. you? If you don't stand up and pray, there's a limit the man in your life can do. Mm. There is a limit. Mm. Mm. Sometimes my husband will feel mm. down and mm. feel probably disencouraged mm. as in discouraged or so. Mm. Mm -hmm. But when I just come around and just speak a word, he speaks fire into his bones and he comes back alive. Mm. You don't know yes. what you carry. Mm. Hey, my God. Mm. Mm. Prophetess Anna was the keeper of the gates. She kept and watched over the fulfillment of prophecy. Yes, ma. She kept mm. and watched over the fulfillment of prophecy. Mm. She did not sleep day nor night. And when she walked into the temple, she could identify prophecy. Mm. Mm. No Until you and I stand up, nothing mm. will happen. Yes, ma. Until you stand up, that situation will not change. Mm. Some mm. things are happening now because the women who should open the doors through intercession are still sleeping. Mm. Your mm. life is the way it is right now because you are supposed to rise up in intercession, but you are still sleeping and still saying, oh, what's going to be is going to be. What's going to be is not going to be. <laughs> Hell, I don't mm. shut up. What's mm -hmm. going to be is not going to be. If you don't stand mm. up and make what's going to be going to be, you need to mm. stand up. Mm. You just say, hey, that is how it has been happening in my family. That's why it has been happening in, in my family. But you need to change the status quo. Mm. My, some of, I, I, I knew of one of my aunties that was having it, finding it difficult to conceive and everything. I became angry. Was it in the year mm. 2018 or so? I became angry. Mm. And I took it up. And I said, God, mm. no. I can't 
cannot be in this family and something like this will keep going on. You have given mm. me power to trample upon snakes and scorpions. And Therefore, scorpions. I take my place mm. and I take my stand mm. in Christ mm. Jesus and I say mm. no to barrenness in the life of my auntie. Mm. Mm. And to the glory of mm. God, the following year, this woman conceived and brought forth. Hallelujah. Why? Because somebody said no to the devil's nonsense. Mm. 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 Don't think you are too small to change that situation. If you mm. can only arise. Mm. If you can only hold on to the horns of the altar. And say like Jacob, I will not let you go unless you bless me. I will not let you go unless you transform my life. Oh God, we mm. are the women that are territorial keepers. Mm. We are the women that are territorial watchers. Mm. Your life is your territory. Your mm. children are your territory. Your mm. home is your territory. Your oh, business is your territory. That you will stand upon your feet mm. and you will go down mm. on your knees and say, mm. Oh God, since mm. this anointing is not gender based, mm. anoint mm. me today uh, that the mm. chains in my family will be broken. Uh, that the chains Hallelujah. in my life will be broken. Uh, that the Hallelujah. chains in my husband, in the life of my children and my siblings oh, will be broken. Uh, the anointing Amen. is not gender based. We are mm. the women that will rise and say, God, mm. because on the day of Pentecost, mm. women mm. were also anointed. Mm. Lord, mm. this is my head. This is my life. Anoint me today because I am mm. tired of the situation. I am 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 tired of so long mm. as you have a living altar, your altar mm. is alive with the presence mm. of the Lord. There is nothing mm. impossible for you to do. So long mm. as your knees are active and your altar is alive. Yes, ma'am. When Jesus yes, Christ healed that man, the leper, what mm. did he do? The Bible says he picked up his bed. He mm. just said mm. Mm. And he went. Mm. Can we women mm. pick up our beds? Dust mm. it. Look for where your mm. prayer altar is. Dust it. Clean it. Mm. Because that is where mm. you are made. And that is where you are made mm. things. Mm. Mm. They have concluded about your life. Tell them, don't worry. Mm. Mm. Let me locate mm. my altar. <laughs> they have <laughs> said you <laughs> will never marry. <laughs> Tell them, don't worry. Mm. Mm. Let me locate my altar. Mm. They say you will not mm. have children. Tell them, don't mm. worry. Mm. Let, let me find mm. my altar. Mm. You cannot mm. be a praying woman and have a living altar and have a disfigured life. You cannot. <laughs> Mm. I have never seen men, women mm. that gave themselves to the Lord and their lives mm. were disfigured. Mm. We can mm. list and list mm. and list and list. Mm. Mm. They said mm. I had a disease called systemic mm. lupus erythematosus. Me. <laughs> they said I cannot give mm. birth to a normal child because of the disease. Mm. Mm. But mm. 2016 February, Mm. I took the drugs and I said, God, if I die, I mm. die. Mm. But I am not mm. living on these drugs again. Mm. Because I've been taking it. Mm. I mm. dumped it. And I said, mm. God, you will bless me with the mm. fruit of the womb. Because you mm. told me that none shall be barren in the land. Be barren. Mm. And mm. number three, Lord, mm. you will give me a perfect and a complete child. Mm. 
Because the Bible says whatever the Lord gives us is good. <laughs> and God blessed me and gave me Hallelujah. a completion. And since 2016, systemic hmm. lupus erythromatosis has not resumed and returned to my body. Because it one not woman forever. <laughs> said something that my body cannot hmm. be the temple of the devil. The Lord Hallelujah. and the sickness cannot be sharing my body at the same time. Hmm. It belongs hmm. to the Lord. Hmm. Hmm. Sisters, hmm. You know you mm. have abandoned your altar. Look for mm. brush. Go and mm. dust it. Mm. Look for your knees. Get mm. back there. There mm. is power in your tongues. Tabo there is power in, in the abos. That is why if a woman causes a child, that curse mm. stays. Because there is power in you. Can we lift up our voice right now and cry out to the Lord that all Lebo shikanda bo zeke di asha ma zeke di asha bo zaba mba shila bo zeke di mu zeke di abra shida kada zende ya bo ma shida ba kada ba shanda kili ya zandi ya bo mu zindi ya bo shanda kili ya zanda ba shida kada ba zha mu zindi ya bo shanda ya ba zanda kada ba shanda kili ya bo mu zindi mu zindi kadi ya bo Masanda I can also raise the dead because I have yielded her. I can heal the speaker because I have yielded her for the things that I have blessed my own Lord have blessed your body and the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall not be the man of the dead that shall I am beautiful Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, was, I'm about leaving right now. But I just mm. want you to know something. Mm. You are not just beautiful for just in, for men to be pursuing you all around just because of your physical beauty. Mm. No. Mm. There is an inner beauty mm. that is mixed mm. up with fire that needs Hallelujah. to find expression. Mm. It's inside of you, but it is mixed mm. up with fire that needs to yeah, find expression. Oh, that even when men was. look at you, they will never mm. resist you. Yes, ma. You just find mm. favor wherever you go to. Why? Mm. Because you have awakened the inner mm. beauty that's been mixed with fire inside mm. of you. You have brought it out. Mm. Mm. In the lion mm. kingdom, hope you know it mm. is not the man that pro that goes out to look for food. Hope you know it's not mm. the man that guards the territory. It's the lioness. Mm. Mm. If you don't mm. know, the lioness that is guards. The, what the, what the lion do is they secure mm. their women. They secure <inaudible> their women. <inaudible> <their house. inaudible> <inaudible> <inaudible> protecting the children and looking for food is the responsibility mm. of the lionesses. Mm. 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 You will see where lionesses are fighting over a, a lion. Mm. Just to see, get his attention. Mm. See, mm. if only you know the power inside of you, Boshi, that you will not allow that, yeah. the devil to mm. trample on you. Mm. Yes, the devil will not make you a football <laughs> that he tosses to mm. and fro. Mm. Because mm. you know, I mm. told somebody something. I mm. said the devil is afraid mm. of people that know and know what to do with what they know. Mm. He's afraid <laughs> of them. Yes. If the, if you now yes. realize that you are not ordinary, mm. you become a mm. threat to the devil. Mm. Mm. You become a threat to the mm. devil. Mm. 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 If you know that mm. you also mm -hmm. are carrying the anointing of the Almighty, you become mm. a threat to the devil. Yes, ma. Yes, ma. Where are the women? That will take mm. the battle to the devil mm. at the gates. Mm. They will not mm. run anymore. Rather, mm. they will come face to face because they know that greater is he that is in them that is in, mm. than he mm. that is in the world. That is in the world. Hallelujah. And that is women. Mm. Amen. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Wow. The Lord bless you, Mark. The Lord bless you. Amen. The Lord bless you. 
The Lord really, really bless Amen. you. This is this is an awakening Amen. for us. This is a great Amen. awakening for every woman. And even if you're a man and you are watching, I think this is a challenge for us. And this is just a tip Amen. of the iceberg. We are still coming back tomorrow. Same time Amen. on this same platform for another one. Just prepare your altar and see what the Lord is going to do in your life. Woman of God, we Amen. celebrate you. God bless you. We are blessed Amen. sincerely. I have, Personally, I have been blessed. And I know that tomorrow again, the Lord will give you more grace, more strength yourself and the other guests. And our lives will not be the same again as a result of this conference in the name of Jesus Christ. For everybody watching, please share the video share invite other people tomorrow by 12 p.m live will be coming back again and you are going to be blessed i say to you your life will change everything around your life will change your altar will come back on fire if there's anyone you know who is supposed to be a part of this meeting share the video invite them let them be a part of it send it to your wives your 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 sisters your friends and i know we shall return with a testimony i welcome you one more time to moment of intercession and this is women on fire conference we'll meet again tomorrow by the grace of the lord and i know that in another testimony and power packed meeting will be waiting for you 12 p.m by the grace of god the lord bless you in jesus name amen